Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Banjo Kazooie Part 3. Yeah. Today's video we're going to tackle Clanker's Cavern, which is uh, kind of where the game spikes up in difficulty. Oh, really? Mm hmm. And right here. Also, Bottles is yeah, an ass. Bottles reveals to us that if we just press that Z button, we can just put all the pieces in at once. Bottles. Every time you say Z, I die a little bit inside. Z. A B C D E F G H I J K L N M P Q R S T U V W X Y and Z. <sighs> anyway. Dragon, dragon, rock a dragon, dragon ball, Z. Oh, that one got me. <laughs> 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 I knew it was coming. It still got me. <laughs> um, so. I love the fucking HUD world for this game. The hub world? Mm -hmm. Gruntilda's Lair is a pretty great hub world. Um, uh, bested only by the hub world of Banjo-Tooie. Banjo-Tooie's hub world is amazing. It is uh. ginormous and it is freaking awesome. I still have Banjo-Tooie I haven't completed on my Xbox. Yeah. But then again, I kind of don't want to play my Xbox anymore. It just sits there and I'm like... I don't want to touch you. you. I, we, we had a thing once, but now it's kind of like awkward and mm, I don't know. Your dad is really, really mean. Yeah. Whoops. Whoops. Butterfingers, butter, butter toes, mm -hmm. paws, whatever. Butter, butter paws, I suppose. So um, I'm not. I told you I wouldn't. I wouldn't criticize you. Yeah. For this, uh, I'm gonna keep trying to do that. Right. Okay? Yeah. Rightly so, because. Today's video is where I start having a little bit of trouble with the game. Oh! Yay! Yay. <laughs> Not right here, but a bit later on. Um, I mean... Uh, Clinker's this, Cavern is a bit tough. This level just of how is a lot of swimming, and as we have discussed in quite some detail, the swimming controls of this game are fiddly. So it's time for the big reveal of Clanker. Oh yeah. It's time for the thing that made a lot of children very, very frightened. Here it comes. Oh my goodness, what is that? What? Look oh. at those teeth. Look at those teeth. Oh. oh! But after all is said and done... He's e a nice guy. Even though Clanker is horrifying, I feel really sorry for him. Yeah. He's just, he's a garbage disposal, he, and you know what? Yeah. He's a nice garbage disposal. He doesn't want to eat you, he just wants help. He may be a giant shark, but he does a job, and he does it well. And it's our job to make sure that he, you know, gets some fresh air, because he's been down there for quite some time now. Um, down here, this is the lowest point of the level, and... Can you hear the music? Yeah. It changed in pitch totally. Oh, that's yeah. creepy. Also, there's a ginger down here, and it hides right around the back, and is when I first played the game is where I was, uh, like, going through, hey, like... Hey, Gloop! Yeah, it's Gloop. Um, when, when I first played through the, the level, I was like, where's that last ginger when it was down there? <laughs> it's easy. You didn't to, hear the... Easy uh, th it's really quiet here. You could have... You didn't hear the... Um, I might have done, or I may have just forgotten. I'm not sure. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, there you go. He's gonna yeah, get some fresh air. Yeah. You're a good guy, Dex. Yeah, I mean, well, you kind of have to do this. <laughs> it's mandatory. Um, Still, you're a good guy. So See? Clang has some fresh air, and his our, our reward is on his back. I like how. I like how Gruntilda was like, hey, th you, this is extremely important that you do not give this Jinjo to Banjo-Kazooie. However, I'm going to lock you down here, and so you don't get, don't get fresh air. Yeah. Dex, there are a lot of things that she hasn't thought through. Also, this is really painful. I'm like, I need to get... I need to bubble. Uh. Right, okay, so in my defense, those bubbles are 2D objects in a 3D environment, and it is really difficult to get You're them. gonna die. No, I'm gonna be alright. I'm just going to make it just. Holy shit. <laughs> yeah. 
I was. Were you fucking touching cloth? Yeah, the whole time I was screaming like, no. Hey, you cut swimming down there. Yeah, Good don't need to see that again. Um, but yeah, we've got these really awkward controls and trying to collect those 2D bubbles in a 3D space is not fun. Not fun at all. Whoop. Whoop. God. Gotta get, gotta get the notes and also don't want to die because if I die then we lose all of the notes we've collected and we gotta recollect them again. I I was not okay with how close to death you are going right now. Yeah, it's it's a nail biter of an episode. It is. This is terrifying. Shit. Well, we got all the notes. No, there's one down there. No, we got them all. We got them all. Dex, Dex, there is one down there. No, we got them all. Pretty sure we had. We got all of the notes right there. So we're just gonna carry Dex. on. We're just gonna carry on as normal. Dex, I saw it! What did you see? I'm interested. I saw a note! Oh no, I'm, I'm pretty sure we got all of the notes that were down there. Dex, this is that's where you fucked up, isn't it? You said last I, episode that you'd messed up. I, I I don't know what you're talking about. Anyway, so there's some notes right here on Clanker's back, along with some more notes over here, and of course, your Jiggy after you lifted him up. Yeah, that's Jiggy 1. Yeah, Jiggy 1. I like how the notes are just butting in on it. Mm-hmm. Oh, but no, Clanker's teeth hurt now. We got a quick impromptu dentist. Yeah, Banjo and Kazooie are trained dentists. Do not attempt what Banjo Any and Kazooie... Any about what you're going to see later. Yes. Do not attempt what Banjo and Kazooie do later. So... It is we got, very imperative. We got a uh, Jiggy over here behind a grate. And just fire a couple eggs at it. And... Up comes the great. Oh, that's three eggs. So there's a jiggy at the back of Clanker, and there's also a jiggy towards the front of Clanker, which we can get to. Whoops. <laughs> I like how for a short second you went, no, oh. Uh, yeah. If you fall uh, a large distance, Banjo kind of goes, no, uh oh. And, and he, may, he, like, if he falls far enough, he, like, yells really loud. Oh! Yeah. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. We'll hear plenty of that. <laughs> yeah, I like how that that metal is pulsating. Whoop. Yeah, it's kind of creep, kind of gross. Another kind of gross thing is like all the exposed like flesh underneath all that metal on Clanker. Holy shit! I just realized I've played this game a lot, but I never thought of the ramifications of this. Clanker isn't a machine. No. No, he's, he's not. He's a shark with metal yep. riveted to his flesh. Mm-hmm. So. Horrifying. Very oh, difficult to see and quite difficult to get, but up here there is a honeycomb piece, and I'm trying desperately to get at it right now. I'm like, oh, where is it? Urgh. Oh, there it is. There he is, a little bastard. We got him. There we go. Just gotta swim down here and Come back up for some more air before heading right back down. This, uh, the layout of this place is kind of confusing, if I remember it correctly, because mm. it's like there's so many different ways you can go just from this one room. Yeah, there are. But you look at all the exits and you go, there uh, are like, have I gone there? There are, yes. there are like, uh, five. I think five. There yeah. are five ways. Five in, or six. There are five ways into Clanker, and then there are five, like, tubes that you can go through. There are five like pipes that with really big openings, kind of like this one that you can get to, and then on the very uh, bottom underneath Clanker, there's like four or five smaller tubes with stuff inside of them. So yeah, there's a lot to explore in this level. It kind of opens up quite a lot more than say Treasure Trove Cove, which maybe had like three. No, it's two. more open spaced. Yeah, there were like maybe two places you could go to in Treasure Trove Cove. Okay, so here are the mutant snippets. Oh god! They have one giant eye and one oh god, giant eye. claw, and they are wrecking me. Ouch. Dex, are you are you are you oh, gonna die? No. I go fuck this shit, I'm fat enough. 
You did it. You're doing it. And Sticky honey tasty energy. Yeah. They they really cause me a lot of trouble and usually they don't, but like they all just kinda ganged up on me and I couldn't really get enough distance between me and them. This guy was just like trying my patience. Hey what's going on guy? Oh, oh. And even though they're all dead, they're speaking to us from beyond the grave, I suppose. Beyond the grave! <laughs> so make sure you get all these notes. Alright, back we go. That makes you move faster, and that's okay. Yeah. I mean, oh, whoop. Uh oh. There are. Whoop. Uh oh. There's the uh, the backflip can be a bit awkward sometimes too, because it kind of propels you forwards a little bit. Oh yeah, it does a curve. Yeah. So you gotta get it just right, otherwise you could really mess you up. That backflip's killed me a few times. <laughs> Same here. Yeah. It's okay, Dex. We both died. Yeah. On the inside and on the outside. <laughs> Spiritually and uh, emotionally. Mentally. Yeah, mentally. Um, so right up here, we come up here and utilize the shock jump spring. All right. Whoop. And there's a couple of notes. So you gotta kind of gotta come up here. There's not much apart from a couple of notes. Eggs and some feathers. Some feathers and eggs, but like. So I'm noticing some new feathers actually. Oh yeah, the gold feathers. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We'll learn about those. Soon. Sort of. Later on in the video. We'll learn about this. Alright. Mumbo token drew here. Beacon Boca Mumbo token. So this is what I was talking about. There's lots to see and do right here. In, in this Clinker's little, Cavern. Yeah. Clinker's Cavern. See the sights. See the sights. Smell the awful smells. <laughs> These are the garbage shoots you're realizing. Yeah. God, it must stay. Gratilda was like, Gratilda was like, eh, I'm done with this baby. Hmm. Hmm. So we got, uh, was it three out of five gingers, I think, now? Yeah. Yeah. God, that's horrifying. What is? <laughs> Flesh. Oh, yeah. Like, I need to remind you, this game was rated E for everyone. This, was, this was back when the ESRB wasn't total prickheads. Well, though. yeah, this was when they were a little bit more lenient. But, like, this was still considered a game for children, and I played it when I was, like, eight years old. Well, same here. Mm -hmm. It wasn't, like, a huge thing. It was just like, oh, hey, there's a little bit of blood. Not a big deal. Yeah. But back, but this... now, it's like, even a tiny speck of blood will be like... Oh, 15. Oh, teen! At least 12. Probably higher. Mm -hmm. Peggy 12. Fucking Peggy ratings. Yeah. Well, like, it's weird. Like, there's the ESRB and, the, and Peggy. Peggy just sounds funny. Yeah, it does. So, some notes here. Carefully. Where's and the Jinjo? In the pipe? Jinjo is in the grate. He's hiding. Man, that Jinjo just sounded great. Our friend, the orange Jinjo. <laughs> I heard that. You laughed. Whoops. Oops. <laughs> that one up. I'm loving the editing here. Just, just get any mistakes, I make this fucking comb out. And that's one honeycomb. That makes seven. Seven honeycombs. Well done. So, Some more mongo, mumbo yeah, tokens. We've got like ten of those things now. I don't even think we need that many. I was gonna say, do we fucking need that many? Possibly. I'm thinking, though I'm probably wrong, but I'm thinking that we need like eight for the next level, which is when Mumbo will appear again. Because we haven't actually seen Mumbo since the beginning of the game. Mm-hmm. I think he's in the next level, right? Yeah, he is in the next level. And then we won't see him again until the- Freeze easy? No, second to last level. All right, we're gonna. The do... next level is um. Ne the next level after this one. That's just very rude of you. I'm just we're just doing some on-the-spot dentistry. I mean, you're shooting him in the face, Dex. 
Oh, well, I missed a little bit. I'm sure he doesn't mind. You just okay, gotta dip a little bit into that water, clear that egg right out. So we're now inside of Clanka's cabin. But you know what? These aren't mutated. No, somehow the ones inside of Clanker are all right. Not quite sure how that works. I guess the, there was maybe some mutated, mut, mut, mutating gunk they got dunked in. I don't know. You can't see it, but I'm just shaking my head at, at this. Oh yeah, like these things. Are, oh, these are gross. Mm. Don't touch him, they, cause they will hurt you. That's why I was avoiding you. All right. So in here we gotta raise the water level, and we do it by going through these rings. Green rings only. If you go through blue rings, you are a you are a pleb. If you're going through the trying to go through the blue rings, you're doing it wrong, and you'll probably have to start over. Nice jump. I don't really know. I like how that one that one swinging tentacle in the middle is just like, come on, buddy. Yeah, come on, man. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> come on, touch me. It's okay. It's not okay. It's not okay. It's not okay. <laughs> they have little. They look like they have little, uh, like tendons attaching they them to the ground. They do. Ugh. It, it, it's not the fact that they. It, that's what it looks like. That's exactly what it is. It's like baby teeth. They have the tendon snapping in my place, ooh, and you. Ooh, oh, ooh, yeah. ooh. This place is gross. <laughs> <laughs> That's six jiggies. The things we've done, the things we've seen in our live streams compared to this is is like nothing. But for some reason, this holds a special place in our heart. It's yeah. fucking disgusting. Like, it is gross. Oh, I remember. There's a Jinjo down there. Yeah, there is. He, I think he's Oh the god, last he's next to one of the tendons! He's, he's even the last Jinjo, yes he is. Very god, nearly got it. very nearly got hit, but I just don't managed to stay away. Do you get hit by one of those? No, I actually don't. I don't oh think. thank god. Just touching one of those makes my skin fucking crawl. Yeah, like that's <laughs> what it feels like. Ooh no. No no. 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 Yeah, this is the only bit Oh god, of, there's a huge yeah, one! Yeah, there's one on the ceiling. This is the only bit of flying that we'll do in, um, Clanker's Cavern. Clanker's Cavern. I don't even think there's any flying at all in, um, the next level. I'm trying to get this and not fall. That's why I'm doing that. I was really paranoid oh. about falling back down. Oh, look! Oh. Death. There's bottles. He was hiding. Biko's being Biko's, Biko's wings. wings. So mean. Well, okay. Hold Z, push right C. And that activates. Oh, there we go, the gold feathers. He gives us five gold feathers. We had six, so that makes ten. And he also fills up our energy a little bit. That's something oh. Bottles does every time you learn a new move. If you've lost some energy, he'll give he'll give you some. But here we go. Oh yeah. Oh god, the music. Oh, so that's it's the. It sounds so good. I believe that that move is called the Wonder Wing, and it will protect you from everything. Although it will uh, it only lasts for uh, as long as you've got uh, gold feathers. Gold feathers, yeah. Do you think that like Kazooie is just like, yeah, it's okay, Banjo. Her wings are sliced. Yeah, her wings are just like broken and beaten. Bastard. Next time, next time they try to do the fly move, it's just like they fly up in the air and then it comes crashing straight down. <laughs> yeah. I can't flap my wings, Banjo. Banjo, I'm sorry. Why is, why is Kazooie turning into Ridley? <laughs> so there's so uh, now we gotta take out that other tooth. That's while giving Clanker some some other. He's two feet hurt. Yeah. I accidentally activated Wonder Wing there. I have a bit of yeah. trouble here. I'm like, Clanker, let me in. Go, come on, Clanker, play the game. Clanker. Clanker, let me in, please. I need, I need to go in here, please. Clanker, come on. Oh, go, go, go. There okay, we go. There we go. Clanker's like, okay, I guess this once. 
That was Jiggy 9. One and Jiggy left. Jiggy 10 is down inside of Clanker's blowhole, even though he's a shark. Oh, look. Hey. <laughs> that oh, God, what? That always makes me laugh. <laughs> I love that. Just, like... Imagine like they're but they're like magnifying glasses zooming in on something, just like how's it going? <laughs> wow, something really interesting on the ceiling. <laughs> Somebody wrote fuck you, Grintalda on the ceiling. What the hell? Wow, who the hell did that? Meanwhile, Kazoo is just like <laughs> That's totally something Kazoo would do. <laughs> yes it is. She's in like bright pink marker pen on the on the fucking ceiling. Gratilda is stupid. <laughs> it spells stupid like S T O O P I D. S T U S T U P E D. Stupid. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's it. We got everything. But Dex, we no, didn't. We got everything. It's time to leave. It's, that's been part three of Banjo Kazooie. That's Clank's Cavern. Dex, please go back. Clank's Cavern. That's it. We're done. Dex. Wait. This isn't a joke anymore. Wait, hold on. Wait, what? Hmm. Where's... 92! Oh, no! No! 92 is not 100! So, there's some notes here. Did you forgot? 1, 2, two three, 3, 4... Four. Wait a fucking second! 99?! What?! Oh, there it is. Okay. Now we I could just hear. I, I could hear the rage coming through. Just the anger. When I was actually recording it, I was like, when I got, like, when it said 99 notes, I was like, Are you fucking kidding me? 99 notes! When Because that's I when you know it? you missed it somewhere. Yes. Because when I've been recording it, it had been a while, so I was like, where the fuck could it be? I don't remember. I like I actually looked everywhere. Like all you just over went everywhere the level. There's notes. I, I looked everywhere all over the level and they went I bet it's right at the fucking bottom. <laughs> and it was. And so when you watched the recording again, you're like, Yes, ah! I was like ah, ah, ah. You died on the inside. But that is it. That is Clanker's Kevin. Choking aside, this is the end. This is the end. Say goodbye to Clanker. You were nice to him while he was here, but... Yeah. We took care of his dentist... His dentistry. But... We helped him get some fresh air. But there's a huge problem, Dex. What's that? Without Gruntilda, he's going to starve to death. Oh. I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh, yeah. So I was just smashing Gruntilda's eyeballs. Why not? <laughs> just I can see up your shorts, Banjo. Whoa. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> so I figured, you know, why the fuck not? Let's go and open up the next level. Why not? All right. Why not we show how to do that in this video, too? Because no, at hey. this point, I'm like, I need something good to happen after that awful display. You fuck up more, don't you? No. 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 Oh, okay. I stay well clear of that giant uh, land, like, water mine. don't even know what it's called. It's just like a giant mine thing. We. I got a message after the last episode. Remember how we were talking about the... Oh, hey, look. Oh, it's Brent Zelda. Hey, she. Oh, Grunty wears a reinforced girdle under that repulsive dress of his. Ew. Mental note: reinforced girdle. Ew. All right. Ugh. So I got a message from Malik. Oh who, yeah. Uh, for those of you who don't know, he is longtime uh v friend DLP of V and DLP. Yeah. Um. He messaged me and he says in uh. In um. In Treasure Trove Cove. You know how we were talking about that mossy stone? Yeah. He he went off on a he went off on a tangent about how that was uh, the re the remnants of a war that had destroyed the entire area. That's why there are mines there. Oh my 
and explosive holes. Oh my god. Bubblegum Swamp. Bubblegum Swamp. <laughs> I love Bubblegum Swamp. If that's. That yeah. kind of sort of makes sense. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But the music there is so nice. Man. Man. Let's just put a downer on that entire area. I don't think I can yeah. look. I don't think I can visit that area again and not think of that. Just go into the area again. You'll hear the music. And you'll be like, yeah. Oh. <laughs> People died here. <laughs> this was a war. This is a war zone. Oh. That's the end of part three. End on a high note. End on a high note. So, uh. That's it. That's um, it. Spot three. So next, uh, next time we're gonna go to Bubble Gloop Swamp. That's... We'll meet. We'll meet an old friend of Banjo's. We will. We will actually. We will That's meet my... an old friend of Banjo's. That is one of my favorite parts of Bubble Gloop Swamp. Is that part? Thank you for watching, and good night.